Hey, what's happening guys? So today is day 11 of owning the Whoop MG, um, what's it called, Life. You can see my battery life's now at 11%. They estimated it should have lasted two weeks. Um, so I definitely don't think I'll, I'll last. Maybe like I could squeeze it to day 12 on a bit, but uh, definitely the full 14. I think I'll use that 10% just by, by end of today, maybe early tomorrow. Um, I've unlocked a few things like, uh, what else, like health plan. So this is new where I could set what I want to do each week. Um, if I say view my plan, I went with the custom one. So in the, you had the boost, feel better and sleep deeper. Um, you can see my average steps. So they recommended based on my step output to make this the goal. Um, and then trying to achieve that every day. So you can see a few of the days I didn't. Mostly working from day home, uh, working from home days. Um, you can see the days of my activities. So two days of rowing, uh, running on these two days, and then spinning on those three days. So I achieved those, but I only I think I only unlocked it around here on Thursday. So at the time I didn't know that this was the official goal, but in theory I should try and no matter what I've gotten that, but I didn't. Um, so that's quite cool. I find that looking at quite a bit. I've got a few things for you more stats on the, the dashboard. VO2 unlocks in, let me see that here, yeah, four sleeps. So that'll be quite cool to see, um, which will probably be unfit, but still interesting to see and how it goes up. Uh, heart rate variability. So this is from this month, it seems. Yeah, uh, resting heart rate, that, just went for a dog walk, which you could see there, or walk the dog, sorry. Uh, otherwise, fairly relaxing, chilled Sunday. Uh, heart rate zones, you can see nothing went to four and five, which is correct. Calories, starting to show the averages starting to come. What's interesting is that it's only as when I got the Whoop. Before that, I never had the Whoop. So it didn't even import my health data to kind of fill the gap from the Apple Watch, um, which I thought it would have, but it looks like they want their own data. Uh, straight in recovery, so it's the stats I was going to show. Uh, sleep efficiency, so I'm down slightly. I'm trying to think what I might have done differently, but no. Um, sleep needed, so it says here, average is needed is eight hours, 52 minutes, and average hours I'm getting is six hours, 49. And then I think from that, a sort of sleep uh, consistency. So it's fairly the same. Rich for sleep. Uh, some trends. So re restorative sleep. Those are the hours. Um, then respiratory rate. So average is 18.1. Um, obviously, I haven't got a full, full month yet, but it should be interesting how that pulls out, uh, you got the HR zone, hours of sleep, and then day strain. So today was quite a low day, which you can see every summer is here. And then the more active days, with that being the highest. Then uh, what else uh, for the sleep, which is just kind of a bit more of the stats, I was needed. Sleep efficiency, sleep stress, tons of stats. I find myself kind of just drawn to seeing how they are every day. Um, recovery. Yeah. Resting heart rate, respiratory rate, sleep performance. And then for strain. So today, there's literally nothing. Uh, strength activity, steps, um, weekly trends, HR zones, uh, four or five steps, and then calories. Um, that's, that's the main page. And you can see, like, if I were to, I can see the history. So the different days, I've got my journals. And normally, Let's say this morning it asked me for 
the Saturday. So tomorrow being Monday, it'll ask me for the Sunday if I hadn't filled it out or if I left any out, if, if left any missing. Uh, you can start to see the stress monitor, so it picks up when you do your activities. Uh, what else? Um, da, 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 da. Then under health, so current heart rate. I haven't unlocked health span. I've still got 11 more days. I think almost am halfway. Blood pressure, still need buy a blood pressure monitor. So it's a bit of a scam. You, you buy it for blood pressure daily monitoring, but you have to buy the device. <laughs> Uh, heart rate screen so that's there and then stress monitor and then under community so that should be not the highest uh, but you have your different communities and your different stay uh, if you go to chat it should say who's won this week normally but anyways uh, so there's that and then yeah that's it so that's day 11 for me of uh, wearing the Whoop Medical Grade Life 5.0. Uh, if you guys have any questions or comments about it, drop it below. Otherwise, I hope this helped. Thanks for watching.